What's up you guys and welcome to my channel, Being Barley Bree, the journey of a wife, mom, and lady boss, and it's your girl Barley Bree. On today I want to journey with you guys through the assembly of my son's stroller and car seat. So come on guys, let's get this thing started. So in this video, I am about six and a half to seven months pregnant and I figured I might as well get started getting some of this stuff put together because before you know it I won't have the energy or time to do so um, my fiance actually could be doing some of this but he works 12 hours six days a week so the smaller more tedious task I like to take on myself hence the series being called DIY mommy this here is the baby trend expedition sport Two in one and it did come with the car seat attachment that goes inside of the car but we just want to put that to the side for now and um, go ahead and assemble the actual stroller portion and figure out how to attach the car seat um, for maneuvering baby when he's sleeping without waking him up or having to take him out of the car seat <laughs> This process um, should only take me about 15 to 20 minutes, but I like to resort to those instructions just to make sure I'm doing everything right. Um, and at the end of all of this, it was pretty simple because everything just simply clicked into place. So here, I'm going to set this thing not so upright and attach the rear wheels. Um, they just click right into place. You will have to put some air in them, I suggest maybe putting air in them first then attaching them but I'm just gonna have my hubby take the whole stroller <laughs> and put some air in all the tires um, here I'm just checking the brakes to make sure that this thing is sturdy and stable and won't move while I'm assembling the rest of it the front wheel came pre-attached so I just locked that one in place off screen moving on to mommy's cup holder Right now I'm just trying to uh, loosen one of the screws that was pre-screwed to attach it because it should click on but um, I didn't want to break it so I just figured I'd loosen one of the screws and slide it into place and then tighten it back up afterwards. And that's exactly what I'm doing. And if y'all see my little fur baby, that is Sophia, AKA Soso. And she's mommy's little helper until baby arrives. And as you can see, I got it in place. Excuse the acne all over my face. And my mommy friends told me that these prenatals would clear up my skin. But honey, it seems like it did the complete opposite. But stay tuned for um, one of my uh, how I clear my skin regimens, so to speak gonna get into that in another video so here I'm just attaching baby's cup holder on the front of the stroller this was supposed to be pretty easy but with these long nails try not to break a nail or <laughs> do any unnecessary damage to the product itself so once I get it the other side just snaps into place voila she ready y'all she is ready and the last step in this process is can learning how to attach the car seat to the stroller this will come in handy because if i'm ever out i can just simply remove the car seat without waking or bothering baby and slide it right onto the stroller and go there's no transferring the baby so if he's sleeping i won't have to wake him so trial and error as you can see this was completely wrong baby would have been upside down and if he's as busy as he is in my belly outside probably flipped over so we go look at the menu again don't be embarrassed happens to us all try one more time and ta -da, click right into place that wasn't bad at all here's the finished project that was easy thank you guys for tuning in I love, love, love the stroller. And be sure to tune in to one of the many other videos in this series, like me putting the baby's crib together. And yes, I did it all by myself. <laughs> Thanks, guys.